Hello YouTube, welcome back to today's video. It's 2E0 IQJ. Last week we unboxed this radio. This is the FT2DE. In this week's video I'm going to show you how to program a uh, repeater into it. The repeater we're going after is a GB3O wire. And that's at uh, Buckhurst still. It receives on 4309500. Transmits on 4385500. Got a plus 7.6 offset and an 82.5 kHz tone. So how do you go about entering that into the radio? Well, all the videos I've seen online show you how to do it, but they're all American repeaters. So hopefully this video will be of some use because we're doing a UK repeater. So first of all, we need to enter in, make sure we're in the VFO mode, which we are, and make sure we're on FM at the top there, see? If you're on FM minus, just push mode and go through. So it says FM. Now we need to type in our frequency which is 430950 and then we need to hold down the disp button go to config and we've got number 15 which says repeater shift press disp and using the dial at the top there going to rotate it so it says RPT plus and push back going to go down one Number 16, repeater shift frequency, push disp, and it says 7.6. Again, you can use the dial at the top. You can't type it in, you have to use it, the dial at the top. So if you're going down, say it's 6.1 or something, you have to go all the way up 6.1. We want 7.6. And then push back, and then push back again. And then we need to go into signaling. It's really coming through there. And we need to go to number 11, which is squelch type. And push disp. And we've got tone. Let's scroll through tone squelch. DCS. Rev tone. But we want it on tone. It's more likely going to be off on your radio. Just switch it on to tone. And press back. Now we need to go to number 12, tone squelch frequency. Press disp. This point. I'll leave it on 82.5, you can just use the dial at the top to scroll through. You can also press search as well, so when it comes through, that'll pick up its tone on the screen. So if you don't know the old uh, frequency tone of it, or the tone of it, you just uh, wait for it to receive and press search. So press back, and back again. Back again, to get back out of the main screen. When we key up, we should see 438550. There we go, we've got into it. So how do we go about saving it into its memory? We're going to press and hold FMW. Hold it down. Let's go back again. FMW and just hold it down. We're going to go memory right and you'll see at the top there, you see a flash in number 5. We're going to go down to 4, but I'll leave it on number 5. So as long as the numbers I've got, so I'll leave it on 5. And we're going to push memory right, M right. And it's saved into its memory. So if we go to V stroke M, number 5 is 950, which is the bucket steel, which is the one we just done. Key up, it should let us in there. Which is done. So how do we go about giving that a name? Because at the moment, at the bottom there, it's got data I programmed it, and voltage of my battery, I want a name. So if I hold down disp and press on memory. And we've got number three is memory name, so press disp. Now here you can enter in the name of the repeater, which is GB3Y. It's like doing an old school Nokia. So if you want G, push G. If you want H, you push G twice and so on. If you want the capitals, you have to go through it all. Uh, manu um, go capitals, so you have to go through. So if I just get capital G, I'll show you. Capital G, so go through the letters. And then after you've done the small case, it goes to higher case, so G. Then push the forward arrow. We want B. Forward arrow. Number three. Forward arrow. Uh, o. And forward arrow. And Y. Press the forward arrow, so we've got GB3OY. 
We don't just say when nothing is already done, just push back. Back again, back again. You'll see it's now named GB3AY. Ricky up. We should get into the repeater. And there we go, that's how to enter in repeaters into this radio. Hope you found this video of some use. If you have, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, the other button seems to work too. And if you want to do a digital repeater, switch into digital mode and do exactly the same thing. There's no digital repeaters near me. The local one at Welling Green has been um, taken down. Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next video. This is 2E0 IQJ73.